Hi everyone, Letty here. Today I'm going to share with you a little Christmas in July crafting. This I used up a 6x6 paper pad and a 12x12 paper pack and I smashed both. Stay tuned to see what I made. So welcome everyone. Today I am doing a double smash project shares video. I took out this Dear Santa by Cartabella. It was a collection from 2020. I just really love the um, really bold traditional colors. I went ahead and took out the 12 by 12 pack as well, especially so you could I could use up some of the larger like cut aparts and tags and things also by Cartabella. I did have a few scraps left over. I have mostly scrap strips, some of the branding strips, a few cut aparts, but no stickers left over and no like actual papers. I do have a few extra single sheets I had purchased. I'm gonna keep it all together so I can use this next time I feel like using this collection. Let's see what I made using these items so i made five different projects some of these i did showcase on instagram over the past few weeks i made 16 of these three by three cards they were super easy i just took a piece of cardstock that was three by six folded it in half added a piece of paper it was two and three quarters by two and three quarters i added some tags to the front i did pop them up on some foam tape i added some twine added a little white square on the inside that's two and three quarters by two and three quarters as well as a little uh strip from the branding strips or scripts that I had left over so you see where I did pop them up so these were super fun super easy to make I likely will have some videos in the future making these because they're so so easy so then I also made four A2 size cards using one of my favorite not too shabby sketches this was a sketch of the month month from June so you can see here kind of a comparison what it looks like this is such a fun sketch you see here I did a little bit of faux stitching around the uh, outer mat or the larger mat I did do some die cut uh, squares for my little squares and added some of those little cut aparts. So those were my four cards. Then I made six mini slimline cards. And so I used up some more of those tags and those tags did come from the, the large 12 by 12 paper uh, pack. They're a little bit larger than what comes in the six by six. I added some of the cut aparts, added some enamel dots, some scraps, um, and just really had a fun time making those as well. And then these were some of the four panel pop-up six by six cards. I had showcased them and did a little teaser on Instagram. I think I showed a picture like this where you could kind of see there was something happening in the inside. Um, and so this is what it looks like. And I just did a tutorial. Um, this was inspired by Sam Calcott, um, but I did do a tutorial recently using some uh, not, not too shabby products, the Stampin' Dice Set of the Month. So I'll link that video at the end in case you haven't seen it. I'll also link Sam's uh, video in the uh, description box below in case you want to check out the original that she made. So here's a different, a little bit slightly different that has mismatched patterns on the inside super fun though these are so easy to make and so super fun and I feel like they, they bring a little bit of wow factor when you open it so I also made nine six by six gift card holders these are so easy and so fun to make as well and they all of these six by six cards use up your paper very fast which I love so here you see a little pocket to insert a gift card um, and I'll take one out just so you can get an idea it's just a little Chick-fil-A gift card. So you can see here, this is what it would look like when you open it and it already has the gift card in there. So you have a little place to write, which is that white square on the right-hand side. You've got some really cute decorative stickers. You could decorate the back. I'll probably just add a little a label sticker that has my handmade by Party Planner Papery information. Um, but here is the next one. So these are all very, very similar. I just literally cut up all of the papers down to size and then went to town. Here's the third one. Now I will be... Uh, working on a video soon where I do a full 12 by 12 paper pack smash um, and I just make a combination of these two types of six by six cards so if you're interested in seeing a video where we make both types of cards in one video stay tuned make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the bell so you can get notified whenever uh, that video does post um, I am in the process of prepping for it now so I'm hoping to maybe film maybe even later today so that is on its way I'll have a video with both these types of six Six by six gift card holders as well as the six by six the pop-up four panel pop-up cards super fun and i just used up all of the stickers and cut aparts and things that i could again i did have a little bit of scraps left over so this was not a no scrap leftover smash this was just a in general a smash i'm done with it uh and so i just wanted to do some more items for christmas in july and so i smashed up that six by six pad and the 12 by 12 paper pack and again i used the dear santa by cartabella this was a collection from 2020 which was your favorite project let me know in the uh, comments down below thanks for visiting
watching everyone hope you subscribe like this video follow me on instagram here are videos i think you might enjoy and happy crafting